Defensive is also another section which is booming in the market and when it comes to defensive security, we have SOC analyst, threat hunting and incident response. So question is what is all about? So defensive role focus on protecting system from cyber threats and you will be monitoring, detecting, responding to all the incident as they occur in real time. And this role involves a lot of monitoring through the tool like SIM, uh, Wireshark, where you identify potential threats responding to before damage it occur. In last five years, the defensive security role got changed. Now there is a new concept in defensive security is coming, which is called threat hunting or threat intel. So before any attack happens, we have to stop that. The question is, what kind of a skill set is required? You need to have a. Before we're going to discuss about technical, let's first understand the non-technical skill, which is you need to have to sustain yourself in this vertical. The first is called as a proactive mindset. If you are someone who enjoys staying vigilant and taking a preventative measure, defensive roles, so this can be the good part for you. Uh, you have to spend a lot of time reviewing the logs, network traffic, system behavior. So your analytical mindset is very, very important for this kind of a job skill set. The third most important thing, which is very common with defense offensive also like problem solver. So when any security breach occur, so defensive professionals are the one who need to act fast. They have to investigate. They have to resolve the issues while limiting the damage. So if you are someone who enjoy re reacting to any kind of incidents or protecting systems or working with the monitoring tool, this path ideal for you where you can start your journey with SOC L1 then L2, L3. We also have a profiles now like incident responder, blue team member and threat hunting expert. Do let me know in the comment box. I will also make more videos around this area. Thank you so much.